Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. It's Go Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. Thank you for 21,000 subscribers. You guys keep subscribing, liking, commenting, sharing, and please continue to motivate me by giving me stuff to react to. With due time, we'll react to all of your suggestions. So today I'm going to be reacting to Amid that exposes a cunning Christian in Pakistan who tried to outsmart with deception. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. Yes, go ahead, young man. Are you a Muslim? No, I'm a Christian. Sir. Right. Remember, he is not a Muslim. He is a Christian. Thank you, sir. Would you allow me to speak in Urdu? I can express better. No, I can't. If you didn't understand what I was speaking all this while... No, I can express better. No. Okay, speak? I speak in English. Right, speak in English. Okay. Uh, you have been comparing Jesus Christ with many others. I would just like to bring your attention to the Sai Bukhari second volume, page number 740, 13th line. That Hazrat Muhammad Mustafa Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he confessed that Satan touches everybody when he is born. But there were two personalities in this world; they were not touched. And you referred us to Al Maida last chapter. I mean, 116th verse. Why is Kalla hoy sahib ne mariyam anan takul talil na sir kuzuni uniya unay I mean dunat la. So you said like that. So I would like to ask you now, there is a contradiction in two verses and you said that if there is a contradiction in any of the holy book, it is not from God. I am not saying anything and if you want to uh, curse, what, what is please the curse myself. What is uh, the contradiction? Sheikh Ahmed did, didn't curse him. He is trying to play the victim card. Till he was with us, you know, we, we said that he was God and his mother was God. And when he was not with us, Filam Abafi. Now, when he died, I would say. Then we started making mistakes. Now the question is that your belief is that he is still living. And if he is living, then we did not make any mistake. Like, and the contradiction is on the other hand. No, just look, a moment. This sir. is not a question. What sir. you are doing now, you are trying to preach to us. I said, look, what is your question? Sir, I am putting my question. Well, go, come, come forward, man. Put your question. <laughs> Look, so many things you touched already, which calls for half a dozen different lectures, man. What is your question in a my, nutshell? My Can't you look? No, you speak so well English. You wanted to apologize, you want to speak Urdu. What for? Sir? What? No, no, look, what are you being a devilish game? Can you You're playing a devilish game. Sir, you speak please. such good English, you know Arabic so well, and you can't come out with a question. Sir, Ask your question. Sir, please, please. Can you let me have uh, say the question? After all this time, now, he is trying to show that Sheikh Ahmed Didat is not letting him ask a question. What a shameless person. Look, there is a question time. Sir, your father... My friend, I would request you to go leave father, me. I, I am not debating, sir. Look, your father... I am not to your level. Like, what church do you belong to? What church do you belong to? I belong to the Church of Pakistan. <laughs> you see the Munafikin? This is how the Munafiks talk. When you, Church of Pakistan, what does it mean? I said, what church you belong to? I know, sir, there was no church me. in Pakistan before 1947. No, sir. What church? Are you a Roman Catholic or are you a Protestant? What are you? No, sir. If are you, you a fish or are you a fowl? What my, are you? Sir, excuse me for one minute, sir. Now, he is going to dodge the question, what church he belongs to? And, change the topic, and focus to something else. So deceitful. Last time I put the question about Bismillah Rahman Rahim, you never answered me and you just confused me and I went away. And this time again you are not answering my question and I'll be confused and I'll go away. He is playing victim again and pretending as if Sheikh Ahmed Didat could not answer properly and he is shamelessly laughing. You see, look, look, the deception that you are doing now, you please, 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 keep quiet. Sir? You know, Jesus said, Jesus said, beware of sheep's clothing. Beware of wolves who come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly are ravening wolves. You said, you quoted Bismillah last time. What was the meaning you gave in Urdu? You said, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. What meaning did you give? Give now. 
بسم اللہ میں شروع کرتا ہوں شروع کرتا ہوں یو گیو دیٹ میننگ ان اردو لاسٹ ٹائم یو گیو اٹ ان اردو یو ریڈ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اینڈ یو گیو دا میننگ ان اردو گیو اتنا لیٹ دا پیپل ہیئر شروع کرتا ہوں اللہ کے نام کے ساتھ رائٹ سنا یہ نے جس نے کہا کہ شروع کرتا ہوں میں اللہ کے نام سے سنا ہوا رائٹ میں نے ریزرو ریسرچ جسنا شروع کرتا ہوں میں اللہ کے نام سے دیٹ واز ریسرچ جسنا رائٹ لوگ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم دیر از نو ورڈ شروع کرتا ہوں میں یو یو پریٹینڈ دیٹ از اف یو نو عربک یو نو یو کوٹڈ دی عربک قران اینڈ یو گیو دی میننگ از اف یو انڈرسٹوڈ بٹ ناؤ یو ڈیسیونگ ایوری باڈی یو پوٹنگ ڈسٹ ان اور آئیز لوگ بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم means in the name of Allah most gracious most merciful it doesn't say i'm starting in the name of Allah there is no starting there <laughs> so you see no, no, please please do, cha 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 are you muslim you you well consider go back are you muslim <laughs> yes go and sit down I don't want Muslims standing here now. <laughs> right. I'm directly nah. talking. Look. Look, man. Come a little closer. You see, ask a question. Don't ramble. Because when you speak about too many things, I have a tendency to forget. then you will think that i'm trying to evade so look if you have a question go for the heart of the matter yes. so mr d that the quran says wama qataluhu wama salabuhu that they didn't kill him and they didn't crucify him but so in the certain book part of the quran it says they did how do you explain that then i will explain but come like that please make it short look the people look i'm an old man of 70 and i'm on my feet for more than 3 hours you know that I'm one man against the whole lot of you. Look, and I'm still standing on my feet after three hours. It's not fair. We said that was the last question are there. There were two. And then another two came, another three came, another four came, and we're still entertaining you. Look, there's not another community on earth that will do that to you. No Christian will give you that facility. <laughs> But no Christian, no Christian on earth will give you that. But we are charitable. Yes, look. You don't want to get away with it, please. But come straight forward. Make your point and go and sit down. Ask your question. Yes, sir. We cannot separate the human body with the soul. Sir, you want me to go, sir? Because our brother... Ask the question, please. Yes. We cannot separate the body from the soul because we won't identify the, the life. In the same way, we cannot separate God from His Holy Word. We, the Muslims, say... Did he just stated? We the Muslims, say. But few minutes back, he said, he is a Christian. Young man, are you a Muslim? No, I am a Christian, sir. Right. The, the word of God can be recognized through the Holy Prophet as Holy Quran. Now, I would like to ask you, sir, that the Quran is only 1300 years old. How can we say, because God is infinite and he's from the beginning, sir. Yes, yes, carry on, carry on, we'll Sir. give you a rope now. Sheikh Ahmed Didat is giving him a rope to hang himself. God is, God, Go ahead. God is from the beginning, so his word should be from the beginning. Why is it that the Holy Quran is only 1300 years old? Why does Bible begin with the books of Moses? Was Moses the first prophet of God? According to Bible, Moses was not the first prophet of God, and there were many prophets, who lived before Moses. What happened to the revelations, which were revealed to the prophets, who lived before Moses? Like, Enoch, Noah, Abraham, Jacob. When God, in the beginning, He made a uh, son for us, so that we won't fall, fall down because of the light. Why didn't He give us the spiritual son, so that we might not fall down? Why is it? Okay, uh, I can quote uh, another reference from the Hadiths, but I think people are... They see, this like is the sickness eat. I'm talking about. You see, these people, these, you know, subject people, they don't know English. I said, what is the question? <laughs> He hasn't come to it yet. You know, 
look, this is being, being recorded on video. Look, it's being recorded that you are not asking questions. You are making fun, this say that way, and you're carrying on like an eel. You know, look, you haven't asked. Why don't you give somebody else a chance? They might know the art of asking questions. Give somebody else a break. Yes. Come. Who's next? No Muslim. No Muslim. Bad job. Chacha, bad job. That's finished. Like, share, and subscribe to create awareness. We are also available on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, and PalTalk. I actually kind of like um, analyzing stuff. I'm not sure about videos, but I'll analyze in texts that I read. Texts that I read. Um, the fact that the person that edited this clip points out that this guy is saying he's Christian, then he's Muslim, then what, what exactly is he? Is it that he's Muslim and just wanted to ask a question first or what? Because Muslims clearly are not getting their first chance to speak. Uh, others that belong to different faiths are always given that privilege to ask questions first. I just feel like he's a confused person, confused not in a bad way, but confused in certain things and how, or maybe what something may mean. Cause the second time around when he got a chance, he kind of starts with a question, but then he confuses himself with saying more. Sometimes, especially if you're in these big gatherings with tons of people, People are going to want you to go straight to the point, don't preach, don't quote this and that. They just want you to ask the question, you know. So I don't blame Amit Didat for being a little bit impatient. I really don't. Like he said, he's old and may forget the questions. That's what other people should also consider. Don't just consider Amit Didat, consider the people that are waiting in line behind you like if you have nothing to say or you haven't um figured out the right way to ask your question you can always sit back relax and listen to the questions of other people i think that's what i have to say i don't know about you guys what are your thoughts on the way the guy carried himself and the way dr i mean amy did that responded to this your responses are always welcome please motivate me by giving me stuff to react to make sure to give this video a thumbs up Share it with your friends and of course do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next reaction video.